O God, our Father, we do remember in the suffering and the death of the Emmanuel Nine and all those who were victims of senseless gun violence. We remember this awful night in Charleston and even the early morning in Orlando that took place in our lifetime. We share the wounds of the survivors. We recall the pain only because we must never permit it to come again. Our spirit is strengthened by remembering our hope in our strength. That the families could find the strength to forgive him in the days that followed was an eloquent testament to the beauty of God's amazing grace. That our whole city could find itself uplifted and transformed by the power of their example was nothing less than a miracle in this modern world. Dylan Roof was not part of ISIS. He was a homegrown terrorist filled with hate right here in South Carolina. What sense does it make to have a background check law if the background check does not have to be complete before the gun is sold? What kind of sportsman needs an assault rifle to hunt deer? Why do we allow someone who is being expected, who is suspected of terrorism, to purchase a gun but not board a plane? If you can't fly, you ought not be able to buy. 